morning from Kyoto. It is day four of our trip here in Japan. Right now we are heading to an area called Arashiyama. Made it to Kyoto Station. Now we take one more train to Arashiyama. We found that Kyoto Rail is a lot harder to get around than Osaka. We're still trying to figure it out. Japan is confusing a little bit. We've made it to Arashiyama. This is just an area outside of Kyoto. I can already tell that it's quite beautiful. You can see the mountains. It's really nice. So we found ourselves here down by the river in Arashiyama. It's called the Katsu River and it's absolutely gorgeous out. Right now we're going to get a hot drink from the vending machine, some hot chocolate. We are in Arashiyama's most famous spot, the Bamboo Forest, and it is so cool. Pretty incredible, we have the whole place to ourselves. <sighs> okay, we found the restaurant we we're looking for. They serve sopa noodles and tempura right on the side of the river here. We're going in now. Another good meal here in Kyoto. Soba cold noodles, amazing. So I think that's it for Arashiyama. We're gonna head back to the city and see what we get up to tonight. So we got dessert now after that soba noodle dinner and we've got here yoba soybean donuts. So they call it yoba because it's the soybean skin like you saw him making. And I'm guessing it's gonna taste like soy milk, so I'm gonna try it. Tastes like a regular donut, just a little bit like soy milk. A little sweet, pretty plain though. For $2, it's a pretty tiny donut. <laughs> Back at Kyoto Main Station now. That was a much smoother ride than the first time. And now I think we're gonna catch a cab to Kyo Mizudera, another temple, pretty famous temple. Got to Kyo Mizudera. Well, not quite, but we're on the road leading up to it going into some of these shops. This is an extremely old part of town. It's really cool to see all the old buildings and the wooden architecture. On the other hand, this is like the touristiest place we've ever been. <laughs> So 
So we've come to the top of the hill and Kiyo Mizudera is behind us somewhere. But it is ridiculously busy in here. So touristy, but it's still beautiful. So we're here at Kiyomizu Dera now. There's quite a bit of construction going on, which is a little disappointing, but it's still beautiful. And the building itself is gigantic. It was built using no nails whatsoever. And supposedly people used to jump off of the platform. If they survived, it would bring them good luck. But many people actually fell to their deaths. So we just saw this girl trying to go from one rock to another rock because supposedly if you do it with your eyes closed, you will find love. But the crowds are so bad, it was pretty hilarious to watch her try. We are finished at Kiyomizudera. Now we are just walking through Gion, which is a geisha district in Kyoto. Pretty certain we just saw a real geisha, but my camera was too slow and it wouldn't start recording. But I think I got like a one second clip of her. Okay, so we're back at our apartment here and we had a really good day today. I feel like these vlogs are kind of all over the place, so I hope they're easy to watch. And I'm going to sign off for today, but tomorrow we have a big day of plans and we're going to have a very special kaiseki meal, which I will tell you all about tomorrow. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you'd like the videos and want to see more from Osaka and Kyoto. So thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.